friends in this video i want to quickly show you guys how to cite your work properly so this one will help you to complete or to cite properly your collaborative review text anyway. so assuming here is uh, the work in the microsoft word 2016 they're done and they're thinking of how do i cite this and how do i reference it in the proper way so uh, here is the open window and suppose we, I have my introduction section the first, I want to cite the first paragraph in the introduction section I make sure my uh, cursor comes immediately before the last uh, period in the first paragraph click over there then you click on the references menu now under the citations and bibliography Select Insert Citation. Then you can click on Add New Source. Alright, so from this uh, menu, uh, create source. You, you have type of source, then author, the title, journal name, year, or page. So here is a uh, based on journal article. You can choose different type of source. You can choose book, book section, uh, article in a periodical conference proceedings reports and a lot more okay so let's go and locate the source i want to cite i'm going to use google scholar uh say on the site things on Aaron just Aaron click on it and then it's going to load so i have different works for different publications on Aaron's case study Anyone you want to cite, for instance, I want to cite a book on the rise and fall of Aaron. Select this uh, double quote for the citation symbol and want to make use of the MLA citation format. Okay, so now I don't, I, I don't, I don't, I'm not going to choose, I'll just choose the citation procedure here or the, the citation itself and not really the format because Microsoft will be helping me in the format. The formatting so the name of the, the author's name is Fox. Here's the author. Okay, let me just copy all of this, take it to Microsoft Word, a new window, so I can select it one after the other. Or uh, better still, I can just go ahead and type this in the citation box. So it is Fox Lauren. Let's go and uh, type the author's box. You put a comma just as it is there. Lauren. Then the title of the book is Aaron, the Rise and Fall. So write Aaron, the Rise and Fall. Then we have the, um, okay, the publisher. So, okay, so here's the book. So we have to choose the book first. The book, so you have that. Then the publisher, the publisher is John Willie and Sons. Let me type it in here. Yeah, really Alright, so the year it was published 2003. It was published in the year 2003. The city, yeah, the city is not there in the citation. So, okay, so we are good to go. Now, with this, we click on OK, added this citation, and immediately it's going to appear here. So, can you see? So you have the Fox 2003. All right, so and uh, I want to add another citation around this axis at the end of the second paragraph. Bring your cursor right there. Go again and click on uh, Insert Citation. So this is the initial we inserted already. I want, to, I want to add a new source. Click on it. Let's go back to Google Scholar and. Um, Select another source, another source you'd like to cite. Say you want to cite this report of Aaron. Click on this citation icon. So here's a journal. So I'm going back to this and select journal article. Let's change the field. Let's get the author Henry Paul. Okay, we have multiple uh, authors in this case. Alright, so to make this very fast, I'm going to uh, 
I'll copy it, but let me see when to make. I want a little more fitted. Alright, so it okay, good. So I'm going to copy the author. The authors. Copy. So I'll take and paste it here in the authors field. Then go to the title. Then go to copy the title. Just to make it faster for me. Then the journal name. Journal of Economic Perspectives. Click on this. And uh, the year it was published. It was published in 2003. Alright. It's the year 2003. And the pages. The pages are 3 up to 26. Just copy this and paste it in here. So with this, we uh, copy all the required fields then click on ok and there it appears so now we've added two citations so assuming i'm done with the work i've cited my work properly and i want to get in my reference over here so at the end of the paper you can go ahead and click on still go back to you're still on the reference menu click on bibliography the drop down uh, menu we are here so you can now choose which format of referencing you want to you would like to use the bibliography references or works cited so let, let's make it a references so you can select this and immediately the two references you added will appear so and of course you can do your visual uh, editing so go back to him you click on times new one then you select n size 12 and you can also increase the line spacing to double line spacing. So with this, that will help you, you know, reference your work and also uh, cite your work properly. So I hope this video uh, is going to be helpful. And uh, this, uh, let's keep helping ourselves and see how to make progress and succeed in this course. Thank you very much for finding time to watch this video. Uh, like it to just click on the subscribe button and for more of such videos I want to be to help ourselves to have another video ahead.